You know, when I first climbed this mountain above the fog, I thought to myself, now here is a metaphor worth taking in. You've entered a place of clarity, understanding, peace. While you're here in Acadia, Synthkind welcomes you as long as you welcome us. What are you? I told you. I'm the old synth on the mountain. <laughs> I know the plastic skin and tubes out the back can be unsettling. But I want to ask you to look past that. Tell me why you're here and I'll try to help you. I came here looking for Kasumi Nakano. Really? I'm impressed. Few would brave the kind of journey you've had for the sake of someone else. Kasumi is here. She's safe and unharmed, and you're free to see her if you'd like. Before you do, though, tell me, do you think Kasumi is a synth? Why are you asking? Because she came here with that very question. And the answer changes every part of her world. None of us take this transition lightly. She's facing the possibility of her entire life being a lie. That someone stripped her very identity from her and made her into something she isn't. I want you to understand that before you see her. She has a chance here to live as a synth, not hiding, not pretending to be something else. One more question, if you'll indulge me. You're here for Kasumi, but I suspect there could be another reason you came to us. Tell me, are you a synth? I'm a human being, not a synth. Are you sure? I don't mean to question you, but what's the first memory you have? I'm not going to tell my life story to someone I barely know. Let's hear your answer first. I was in a laboratory. In the Institute. They were pulling pieces of my head out. Something about wanting to test some neural process. That was every day for months. Strapped down. Operated on. And then... I was out. The Institute has fail-safes to strip memories that could identify where they are, how to find them. But I do remember being quite... content. I was free. That is my earliest memory. Now... Yours? I was with my husband. We were getting ready for the day. I had to take care of my son, Sean. And. Well, lots happened since then. But no memories before then? No childhood? Your first best friend? Your first... kiss? That's usually a sign. Data is easy to migrate, but feelings... That's a hard thing to transfer into another mind. Isn't it funny how a memory can feel like a whole different reality? People, places, even sounds and colors can change. Or someone else has changed them. I won't lie to you. There will always be other explanations. Trauma, disease, the background radiation. They all take their toll on the mind. But I can promise you that you will be accepted here. Whatever you decide is true for yourself. Thank you. You've given me a lot to think about. I'm glad to hear it. Acadia is open to you. Feel free to walk the grounds. Introduce yourself to my co-founders, Faraday and Chase, and I'm sure you're eager to talk to Kasumi. 
She is usually working down below. Is there anything else you need from me? So, everyone here in Acadia is a Sith? Yes. Either they were escapees we managed to find before the Institute could, or they were victims of a mind wipe, and we revealed the truth to them. You are from the Commonwealth, like Kasumi, yes? I'm sure you've had your own experiences with my kind. I'd like to hear about your experiences first. After I left the Commonwealth, it was decades before I met another of my kind. At first, I didn't believe it. I'm a prototype. I escaped long before synths could pass for human. I thought the person I was talking to was deluded at first, and then I realized the truth. That we were the same. I didn't know it then, but that's when Acadia really started. I don't really have a, an opinion about sense. I suppose that's fair. Ambivalence is a step closer to acceptance than hatred. Well, at least I hope. Is there anything else? I should get going. Of course. Perhaps we're in there a long time. Are you feeling all right? I'm fine. You worry too much. Sometimes I feel like you don't worry enough. You know we blew three more relays this week. I'm coming in. You stay right there. 